Hello, folks! It has been a while, hasn't it? I'm back here on YouTube for just a short while. A short while, my friends. Come Block Home is doing another thing. And I was excited to get involved uh, in some way, any way that we could find. We're all really busy this year, but we came up with this idea of Terraria, past the map. And that's where we are. Now, I am not the person who started this map. We're going to go into single player, and as you can see, I have CBH here. This character has been in the custody of both Lying, who started this, and then the illustrious William Strife, who played through. And we've got about eight, about eight hours so far. So let's find out what's going to happen here. Here we are. Now, I have no idea what sort of shenanigans are going to happen here. So this is me being genuinely surprised when I click this because I Will was like, oh, by the way, make sure you're recording. Rascal. Here we go. Wait, there was nothing. Nothing? You know, Will, Will Strife, you disappoint me. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and just walk around the world a little bit, and I'll talk a little bit about things um, before we get started. First of all, formatting. Uh, I'll be probably doing this more than once, and just to let you know, I don't intend to do this as one big, long, continuous Let's Play, or as a stream. Rather... Uh, I'm going to start as I am right here. Oh my gosh. Whoa, Will, what, what, where did these come from? That's cool. Okay, rad. Um, rather, I'm going to be doing this in sort of a montage thing. So we'll go real time and then we'll go kind of montage as we go. I think this is how the kids do it now. No, nah, I don't know. Um, what do we have to, to fight with? Uh, we have an enchanted sword. Okay, sweet. And uh, I hate this sword. If I'm honest. I hate it. It's not good. Let's pop over here. Is there, like music playing? Okay, it's our it's our bass music. Great. What about the elevator? Is it done? I know that Will spent a lot of time on this. Now, we probably don't need a elevator. Look at this. There's a graveyard over here. Maybe not yet. Soon. Uh, we probably don't need a elevator at this point, but you know, Will loves to dig. So there we go. Uh, excuse me? Alright. Yep, the elevator's done. It's, uh, there's definitely a elevator here. Okay, now. Um, so, what should we do first, friends? I have some ideas. First of all, I think that it'd be really fun to try and do the next boss on the list. Uh, I'm not sure what that is, so we'll have to take a look at where we are. I also think that maybe it'd be fun to try and switch up the weapons a little bit. And finally, I've got to think up something useful to do for the group. Right? We can't just, like... It isn't, it isn't enough just to do a couple of things. Rather, I also want to be able to actually leave the map in a better place than when I found it. So, that's what I'm going to try and do. I think that most the most likely candidate for that is, um, hmm, maybe we could get a basic alchemy system going. I noticed that we don't have any way to make potions, and I sort of love potions in Terraria. I'm just getting my bearings, and, um, we have 13 gold? What happened? That doesn't seem like very much gold. Didn't we have a bunch more? Oh, wait, that's right. We'll spend all of our money on Dynasty Wood. Bro, come here. Shop. Oh, the wandering merchant. Huh? Dynasty wood. Well, I better build something with it. We certainly have a lot. I think I see something glowing off to the left. Did Will miss something nearby in this cavern? It really looks like there's something there. Ah, look, see? Up here. There's a thing up here. There's also Blink Root. Now, wait a second. If I do this, I'm going to regret it, aren't I? That's water. I watched Will struggle, so I'm not going to make the same mistake. Ooh, so much cool stuff here. 
Let's just go ahead and drain it all out. So what do we got here? What have I found that Will didn't? Uh, a mace? Tungsten? A water walking potion and glow sticks. Well, you know what? They can't all be winners. But uh, mm, they can have a loom and paintings and, you know, other great stuff. All right, back to it. Hmm, wandering merchant day. What do you have to, for me today? A winter cape. Oh, that's really, really nice. Lawn flamingo demon horns. Pretty pink ribbon. Pretty pink dress. Life form analyzer. I think we have one? No, we don't. Okay, we're getting a life form analyzer. And, uh... Let's face it, the winter cape is on brand. And if Will can waste money, so can I. I think maybe if I put the piano, like, here-ish? Yeah, we can, like, play Phantom of the Opera. Like, da na na Right, and be up here being all super cool. Why is there a... A, a, a hidden chest chest in here? Full of chests. Is there some plan here I don't know about? Okay, well... Oh, yeah, look at that range. This is a giant toilet. Now that I see it in the day, this is a giant toilet. Why is there a giant toilet? Why is there a giant toilet? Will, why is there a giant toilet? All right, now that I've seen the toilet... I think I'd like to try and make an alchemy system in the toilet. A kind of a, you know, toilet brew system. That seems like a good plan to me. So what I'm going to need is a lot more bottles. We don't have a lot of sand, presumably because Will made this gigantic apartment complex with a bunch of it. And also, I don't think we had very much to begin with, uh, as much as I'd like to blame Will for everything. So uh, off to the desert I go. Oh, yeah, this thing is way nicer. I get that the Enchanted Sword is technically better, but, you know. Alright, I guess we need a bunch of pots to get started with this. Let's make 24 for now. And we'll place them. Oh my god, can we afford the Extendo Grip? Maybe I shouldn't have bought that cape. We can't afford it. Oh, woe is me. Alright, well... I have to slum it out. All right, great. So, uh, we got a bunch of potions lying around, but um, we could probably start growing our own. Got some seeds. We got daybloom seeds. We got silverthorn seeds, crimson seeds, mushroom seeds, blinkroot seeds. That should be uh, a good start. So let's see. How do you, why do I keep jumping there? How do you work? All right, well, um, those should get started, and we guess we have a, a okay supply for the moment. Um, so then the question is sort of like, what can we get going with what we have right now? Let's just see what sort of seeds we have access to. One thing I really like what I'm seeing is swiftness potions. If I'm going to start running around, I need to go faster, and we don't yet have anything that would really help us with that. So, um, yeah, maybe I should try getting some cactus over in the desert really quick. Cactus. Cactus. I'm really liking this mace. It's just a lot faster. So, let's just go ahead and really quick fill up our bottled water with toilet water. Perfect. Oh, thank you so much, Will. This is way better than I thought it was going to be. All right. Now, I think the last thing we need to do is set up an area to actually do the brewing. One, two, three, four, five. Or four, I guess. Still, pretty good. Pretty great. And we got more growing out there, so it shouldn't be that long. All right. Um... Basics of alchemy and the sophisticated use of toilet water, complete. At this point, I was thinking to myself, what should I do next? What can I do that's interesting, that's impactful, that will make an impression on the next person who's playing the map? And I realized that we haven't really started focusing on a class yet. You know, 
And in Terraria, there are kind of like a couple of core archetypes you could play. Most people know this at this point, but I was thinking about it. So warrior, melee, um, mage. We actually wouldn't do poorly as a mage. We've already got a lot of mana. And, you know, then there was ranger. And we've got a couple of interesting things. What about um, Summoner, though? And I realized that uh, I've played Terraria a few times. I haven't played any in 1.4. And I've never played Summoner because people always say it's terrible. It's awful. It's the worst. And I thought to myself, wouldn't it be great if we just chose the worst class and made it work? And it was really frustrating the whole time. And everybody's like, oh my god, Dave, why did you choose the Summoner? It's so awful. And I was, I was kind of like, oh yeah, this is gonna be great. Uh, Will builds a toilet, I make us into a combat toilet. But then I started like reading about it and actually they got kind of buffed and good. So I'm kind of not choosing the worst thing imaginable. But I, after spending all this time finding the materials in the jungle that you need for pre-hard mode good stuff, I realized that I could get us a better grappling hook, the Ivy Whip. I realized I could get us the Snap Thorn, which is the really nice uh, whip for the Summoner. And actually, it's a really good weapon, even if you don't necessarily get a good roll on it. And I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. So what I decided to do was to go and get those things. And it seemed like a good play at the time. Um, I don't know, though. It took a long time in that jungle. I was there fully for like an hour or so. You're seeing some footage of what the, all the things I had to do in there. You have to kill tons and tons of things that hurt you really bad and poison you. That's like hornets and spike slimes or whatever those are, thorn slimes. And then there's these awful man traps coming through the wall all the time and they're or man eaters and they're constantly eating you. It's real. And then you have to find jungle spores, which are just like they're annoying. At least they make light, so it's not so bad. But I definitely took one for the team here in grinding up these weapons. And I realized though, what good is a summoner without summons? So after getting all the materials, I got all the cool stuff that we need, I sat down to craft it and um, thought about what I would do next. There's a ton of stuff we could do. Obviously, the most, most obvious thing to go and do is take on the, uh, the big Cthulhu brain. Um, wouldn't be that hard, I think, uh, to go ahead and dig things up. We've got plenty of bombs. We've got an old man here who's, you know, uh, ready to sell us potions if we need them. Um, oh wow, and a, a mining helmet actually wouldn't be terrible, but uh, nah, nah. Anyways, um, we do have enough bombs lying around. We haven't had uh, anyone who sells them come up. But uh, I've decided what I'm gonna actually going to do is, since we, I, I took all this time to get the whip, um, I think I'm going to go and get some other summoner gear and an actual summons. Now, unfortunately, we the most default summons for Terraria is the goofy little um, sparrow staff, but we don't even get that, right? That isn't available in this world, and we have a no-cheat policy here, right? And it's not like it's down here. I, I wish that it was. It'd be super cool if it was down here. But look, it's not down here. That's just the way it is, and we have to accept it. So instead what I'm gonna do is get my inventory fixed up, and then I'm gonna head over to the ice biome. And that should be good. Um, you know, to basically spend a little bit of time grinding and get equivalent, you know, like basic starter gear. We'll get the um, the new coat, uh, a little furry coat, and we'll get the thing that lets us uh, summon little furry uh, weirdos from the uh, ice biome. I forget their name, and I don't think I care to know it. They're just not that interesting to me, except as, you know, uh, minions. So, give me just a moment, and I'll meet you there. Oh, folks. Change of plans, right as I'm heading over, it's a slime rain. It's a slime rain. All right, stand by everybody. Slime rain protocol is being engaged. And what that means for me is that I'm gonna sit here smacking slime with my big thorny whip um, until such time as uh, we see a big, I don't know, like, I, I, I think what happens is the king slime comes out. That's my understanding of this. And evidently we're supposed to love killing slimes. We're supposed to cherish their pain. Now, as a fan of uh, Sui, um, the slime who is a very, very good slime and a very good child, uh, who loves, I think, all sorts of food. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Sui is a big, is awesome, and Vesper was very concerned, my daughter, when she saw that I was killing slimes. She's like, oh my god, dad, you're killing Sui! 
Now, I want to be clear to the audience that I would not, I would never kill sweet. These slimes are not sweet. Don't worry about it. Uh, these slimes are disgusting. They're just normal slimes. They're not special the way sweet is special. And uh, so we can continue without any real burden on our conscience. Right, after all, they are falling from the sky. I think we just need to get 150 during the slime game, which is going about as fast as it possibly can. Hey, the king slime is here. All right, buddy, come here. Get over here. Whoa, God. I said come here, but... Okay, this is might be a little tricky, but fortunately, we have this fine arena that Will built. Okay. Okay. Whoa, whoa, oh, ow. My body! There's like a little dude in there. Is that just that he's supposed to be a king? Is that how that works? Your Highness, please. Your Highness. Your Highness, we need to- ooh, ow. Your Highness, I, you need to work with me here. This is pretty, pretty straightforward. I'm not too concerned. Whoa! Oh god, that's not good. Okay, that's very bad. I'm now concerned. I'm very concerned. I apologize, Your Highness. Please, please, Your Highness. Your Highness, please, if you could just- Oh, please, just hold still for a moment. Okay, there we go. Whoa. Uh, you little nerd. Get out of here. All right. What do we get? A ninja shirt and a slime gun? Um... A solidifier and a ninja shirt for defense in, and increased cri critical strike. Well, uh, why not? And a slime gun. Squirts a harmless stream of slime, eh? Huh. Why do I want this? But is this really the thing I get? Is this really what I get? No mount, nothing fancy. Just a lot of anxiety, an elevated heart rate, and a squirt gun, and a ninja shirt. Huh. Are those, like, lanterns in the background? Bat, please. Thank you. At least the diggin's pretty fast. Alright, we gotta find some ice caverns. We gotta get down there, we gotta get out on that ice, and we gotta find a good supply of these little flurry bastards. All right, target acquired. There's the little nerds we want to get, at least one of them. Oh boy, and I fell down into it immediately. So these guys, the one nice thing about them is that even though our weapons are not very good at uh, knockback, uh, these guys are super vulnerable. So I just got to find and kill like a million flanks. And I'm going to take their skin and then we're going to wear their skin. This is normal. This stuff is not easy to find. It appears to be Tom. Uh, hi Tom. What you got here? Radar. Really? Okay, I'll, I'll take one of those. All right, by my reckoning, I have enough fink flinks fur. I think. I hope. I'm getting really bored of those caverns. Those caverns are a lot. So, let's see what we can do here. One, please. Alright, now I need silk. And there we go. Okay, Flink's Fur Coat. Uh, it increases your summon damage by 5% and your max number of minions by 1. Seems pretty great for a summoner. We're a summoner now. Don't like it? Too bad. And we can uh, take off the snow coat. I don't know, revel in how cool we look? If it weren't so dark, it might be a little bit better. Boy, look at us. Don't we look cool. Hey, everybody. Don't you think I look cool? I don't look like a hot mess. What are you talking about? Uh, but, um, before I get too f focused on the fashion, let's, uh, let's call some friends. <laughs> Come on, posse. Come on, guys. Guys, we're going. We're doing this. Keep up with me. Um, and with that... I think that we're probably at the point where... Oh, yeah, get him. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I got a posse now. Suddenly things go from hard to easy because we just got a little mob of friends. Uh, and I just found a burger. There's nothing more enjoyable than a burger found in the Crimson. You just know that they're excellent. 
Anyways, with that, I think that probably I've done enough for one session. I don't want to like, oh my god, look at them go. They just go crazy up there. Let's, let's see, let's just summarize what we've done here today. We've managed to, oh boy, uh, we've fallen into a big dark pit of bloody water. Okay. Um, we've managed to correct the deficit that is William Strife's decision to spend all our money on Dynasty Wood. I've left the next person with a healthy sum. Get out of here. Uh, a healthy sum of delicious gold, including, oh my god, I can't get over how ridiculous these guys are. Oh my gosh, my little squad is great. Um, let's see, how much we got here? Can we, can we like, take a look? Um, let's see, so let's uh, deposit all. Well, that's not what I meant to do, but uh, we'll take a moment to redo our inventory. <laughs> Oh my god, loot all. Oh my god. But we have 30 gold, okay? We've got 30 gold here, and that's great. And um, we also have a serious winter theme at play. Uh, a magnificent winter theme. We also managed to get this little honey thing, uh, leave a bunch of jungle supplies, and start making um, some good herbs. And um, we've also been drinking toilet water which I think is a really big accomplishment in and of itself. It real it occurs to me that maybe I should, before we go, use the toilet. Um, and this one's a floater. Perfect, that looks exactly disgusting enough. I wish the next person in this complete mess of a world good luck. Um, I think that'll be Tevla. Now, in case you're curious where else you can see this, I will put links in the description below. If I don't, yell at me in the comments. That way, I won't, right? And you'll be encouraged to do algorithmic engagement, right? This is this is cool. But you should definitely yell at me if I forget to link. I think uh, we have Lying, Tevla, and Will Strife available. And I think the next person is Tevla. And if you're all very good, if you behave very well, perhaps we'll even get another person to show up. Who knows who that person could be. Thanks for watching, folks, if you indeed did make it to the end. Uh, if you didn't like this, let me know. If you did like this, remember to do the, al you know, algorithmics. Bye!